I think everyone has seen the big move in gold year to date, but I think what might be lesser known is that uh, in many ways, gold is kind of just the first one of these hard assets to have made that big move. Now, I'm just gonna show you one of these and we can look at many other ones as well. But look at, for example, uranium. And this is not just about the chart. There's an actual big tailwind from a secular perspective, from a demand perspective there as well. Look at the URA ETF, which is the blue line at the top. And again, you can see gold has already broken out, made that move 30% or so over the course of essentially the year to date. But uranium is really just still consolidating. So, you know, these are the kind of things we're looking at, not just necessarily tomorrow or the day after, but through a multi-month lens where we want to see tailwinds, um, assets that we want to own and trade uh, that have real true tailwinds, not pie in the sky hope, but true tailwinds from a supply and demand perspective and also from a broader perspective where we're in. I'm going to talk about this in our boot camp this week. If you haven't signed up for our boot camp, please do so. We're throwing in a free indicator that you're free to keep. We're showing you a portfolio that we think makes a heck of a lot of sense to consider to implement from an, to, to own inflation as opposed to getting punished from an inflation. So if you're sick and tired of getting punished from inflation, you would like to own inflation, make money from it, uh, make sure you join us now with Bootcamp. Uh, the link is down below or on the next screen. We'll see you there.